many people do simply awful things out of sincere religious belief, really because they believe that this is what God wants them to do. Going all the way back to Abraham being willing to sacrifice Isaac because God told him to do that. Putting God ahead of humanity is a terrible thing. An awful lot of people also believe it doesn't matter whether it's true, you have to be religious because that will guarantee good behavior. I don't see religion as actually uh, inspiring moral behavior. You very often hear people say, well, these people who uh, blow themselves up uh, for some religious reason, that they're not really religious, that real religion doesn't involve that kind of behavior. You see, what's really happening there is that instead of using religion to decide what is moral, they're using their moral sense, which fortunately is a perfectly good, reasonable, enlightened moral sense, to decide what is religious. I really don't like God. In the same sense that I don't like Iago, or I don't like the Reverend Slope, or any of the other villains of literature, the God of traditional Judaism and Christianity and Islam seems to me a terrible character. He's a God who will, who's obsessed with the degree to which people worship him and anxious to punish with the most awful torments those who don't worship him in the right way. He's a terrible character. I don't like him. Um, I have a friend, or had a friend, now dead, Abdus Salam, a very devout Muslim who was trying to bring science into the universities in the Gulf states. And he, he told me that he had a terrible time because um, although they were very receptive to technology, they felt that science would be a corrosive to religious belief. And they were worried about it. And damn it, I think they were right. It is corrosive of religious belief. And it's a good thing, too.